We all know the benefits that a balanced diet can bring. It is the key to fighting a variety of preventable diseases and decreasing the alarming rates of obesity in our community. But in our busy lives, where takeaway food is plentiful, it is easy to forget the importance of healthy eating. Despite the culinary wonders of the Footscray market, the Altona and Newport farmers markets, 50% of my community feel that they can't access fruit and vegetables due to low income, physical disability or lack of access. The eating habits of Melbourne's West are ready for change. And who better to change them than the people's champion for healthy living, Mr Jamie Oliver. Healthy eating and healthy living is one of the most important things within a community. We're here in the heart of Maribyrnong, where the love of food is evident. Today, our aim is to find out what the community loves about food and cooking. We are hoping the Ministry of Food Pop-Up Kitchen, an initiative of the world-renowned chef Jamie Oliver, will choose our community as its home for the next 12 months. Everybody knows that fruits and vegetables are good for you, but they don't understand why. And our research shows that if you explain to people how different vegetables help your eyesight, different fruits and vegetables might help prevent cancer, then they're more motivated to make healthy choices. Why is it important to know what you put in your mouth? Because there's so many additives in processed food, so you don't know necessarily what sugar you're getting. There's enough research, there's enough knowledge to say that if you don't eat high sugar, really calorie dense foods, that you'll be healthier on average in the long run. We prefer to go to the market as opposed to the supermarket just because we find we don't want chemicals in our food, we like to eat as healthy as possible just for general well-being. If you're eating good food then you've got a healthy mind as well, it keeps both of us going if we eat, if we eat good stuff. Why do you agree fresh is the best? Fresh is the best because it's healthy, it's good for you and all that above. If you can cook foods from scratch, you can save a lot of money. You don't have to buy so much takeout food that's high in fat and sodium. You don't have to eat at fast food restaurants so often. So how important is people just have basic cooking skills? Extremely important. I think that's why she married me. The fact that I can actually cook. If you know the basics, I guess you can fend for yourself at home. You don't need to go out so often. You can cook it yourself. You cook it how you want it and it's much more Enjoyable. You know, have your leftovers, so you're saving money there. It's better than eating all the junk food because it's not oily. You cook like healthy dishes. Cook it as much as natural as you can, like that what makes it better. I eat raw as possible, or if not raw, I blanch them so the nutritional content is not lost. You can share, you know, another which is kind of a community aspect, you can learn things from other people. Get cooking Melbourne with a good product. Jamie Oliver, we want your cooking classes here. Jamie Oliver's messages around healthy eating and cooking and fun are really especially important when we're working with children and we want children to develop good food habits that will stay with them for their whole life. Why is it important to have fresh food for the family? My children growing up are very healthy and very healthy living. My family come always together to my house because they like my homemade food and they enjoy it and more healthy. Yeah? Families can work with their kids to show how great it is to cook with fresh food. So people who don't eat healthy have chronic illnesses and all these sorts of problems and then they'll need support from the community where I think if you can just attack the problem right at the beginning, have everyone eat a lot healthier. Maribyrnong is a central hub for health services in the western suburbs of Melbourne. With over 180 health services networked through the Medicare Local, taking the Ministry of Food message to the people in the community will be a great way to promote the services. Maribyrnong is a community that has a higher than average level of chronic disease and there is so much potential for lifestyle change. Food in particular is important because if you're choosing the wrong foods you increase your risk for heart disease. Helping people with their food choices in critical states, especially pregnancy and childhood, is really important in preventing disease and we can prevent chronic diseases if we intervene. We're so lucky here in Australia to have such great fruit and veg to get those the true nutrients out of it. We are lucky in Maribyrnong, we are so close to the markets and they are introducing a lot more organic kind of uh, stores and smaller cafes and things like that. How much did you ride today? Seven and a half to work, it'll be seven and a half home. So I guess you do believe in healthy um, living and healthy eating. I'm doing well, I've lost five kilos in two and a bit months. Eat healthy and love life. Jamie, your Ministry of Food pop-up kitchen would be perfect for Maribyrnong. We have such a rich cultural 
diverse heritage here. We have so many foods available. People who've grown up in Australia don't know what to do with many wonderful ethnic foods. People who are new to Australia don't know what to do with some wonderful locally grown Australian foods. Jamie, we want to see your big body, number one, and number two, your best cooking, so we can learn from you, so you can teach the new generations about cooking. We need to teach people to cook healthier for healthier lives, healthier families, and healthier communities. Passion meets food. 52 kilo. I want you to come, Jamie. Jamie, Jamie we, we want, want you in Maribyrnong. Hey, Jamie, we definitely want you cooking in Maribyrnong, so come on over. Jamie, Jamie we, we want, want you cooking in Maribyrnong. Jamie, we want you to come to Maribyrnong. You're very welcome in our kitchen, so please come. Mr Deputy Speaker, there is nowhere in Australia that would benefit more from the expertise of the Ministry of Food. We have both the need and the community infrastructure to make the Ministry of Food a success. We have world-class facilities at Victoria University's Footscray campus where the kitchen can be based, close to the people that need it the most. So I say to people in Melbourne's West, join the campaign, like the Facebook page, tell your friends and help bring Jamie Oliver's pop-up kitchen to our community. I love food. Yeah, thank you. <laughs>